We're here with Trisha from What True Daily. Trisha, is this sax effort different from other things that you've seen? Um, it's not exactly different, but I think that the fact that they're concentrating on beauty products shows that they're really looking to reach that aspirational consumer instead of having these products that are hundreds of dollars and really aiming at those affluent consumers. I think the brand's trying to show that it is also interested in reaching aspirational consumers and um, being able to show these products. I mean, they are showing a few you um, clothing items in this boutique so you know they're keeping some of the items higher end and I mean the makeup is still um, all luxury or I should say many luxury brands um, are being showcased YSL and Dior's um, beauty lines so I just think that um, it's doing what other retailers are doing but it's putting a personal stamp on it it's not directly copying anything that's been done it's using its own um, types of style and its own products but I think that shopping guides, you know, they have been done before, so every retailer that does it should really aim to personalize it to their store.